Hello techies. All right, today we are going to be troubleshooting a startup issue on this PC. All right, so let's get into this. This PC obviously has um, an issue somewhere. This one of the cable is not plugged in. I guess this one that is plugged in is just for the monitor. So let's go to the back of this PC and see what we have in the back. All right, it's plugged in here, but it's not plugged in here. So let's take this and connect it here so it's plugged in now is there anything we need to do here everything appears to be fine here so let's go into the motherboard and see what we have inside we click on this this doesn't appear to be connected you can see the cable says unconnected but it has to be connected so let's take these to its port here it's connected now is there anything here that is not connected yep 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 on the board you can see that the um, or the peripherals here are not connected so um, we will check on that so um, let's start up we are going to go to the the motherboard details details and then go to the specification and see what is connected and what is not all right so scroll down to this page here and we're going to take this to the side and then we click on the case so that we see all of the uh, peripherals that are not connected yet so we have the power switch here is the power switch it is not connected yet so we'll connect the power switch I'm gonna take this and we're gonna connect the power switch switch is connected uh, connector case connected HDD LED is not connected so let's check where should it be HDD LED HDD LED is not connected all right so uh, uh, fan fan is not connected so I guess the fan has to be here why the other one is going to be here somewhere around here yep all right so um let's see what else what else this is not connected hdd led is not this is here and um speaker case this is a speaker speaker should be somewhere around here yep all right so i guess everything here is connected let's go back and check the power area if there's anything left to be connected in the power area um everything that we need to connect in the power area hard drive hard drive is connected uh, yep yep connected 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 all right so i guess everything here is connected so let's try this and see if there is something we're missing let's check the drive base everything here appears to be connected and the motherboard okay the drive base are connected all right so i will just go to the front and we start up and see let's start up yay so i guess we've been able to fix the issue all right so let's check our answers and see 100 percent everything is done here if this video was helpful remember to share so that others can benefit also like and subscribe thank you for watching i'll see you in the next one